All right, this is a quick unboxing of a package that I got from Lion Wholesale Batteries. It is some 18650 cells. And I was initially gonna get these for, for the bike I'm modifying, but then after I ordered them, I realized they don't, their maximum amp hours aren't big enough. So I'm gonna add these to my other pack. If you can't tell, I'm pretty new to... Oh, look at that. Look at that. Should be 38 of them. Let's see what they look like. Oh, no, I get to test every one of these. Gosh, I love testing batteries. Ah, oh, it doesn't open very good. Alright, there's what they are. Samsung INR18650-29E. I don't remember what they were. Let me look it up. Twenty-eight fifty, right? The maximum amps on these is 2.75 continuous. So, I mean, it can spike up higher than that, but that's why I'm gonna be using with my other battery pack. Um, what are they? They're rated at 2850 milliamp hours. So we shall see. And you can see you can see what it costs on there. So they weren't too bad, but they're not high powered cells. If you put something like this in your e-sig, it'd blow up. Yeah, love it. First time I've ever got brand new cells. Let me show you what I'm going to be adding them to. It's like my Frankenstein battery. Hold on. I'm going to be adding it to this pack here. This pack I built about, I don't know, two months ago. I got all these cells from Black Friday. Let's see. I bought a whole bunch of these chargers. I think they're 2100 milliamp hour rated for chargers. They were $15 Black Friday. So I bought like 15 or 16 of them. Well, turns out they don't have a good max discharge either. I'm guessing they're going to be at about 2.75, about the same as this blue one. These aren't 18650 cells. These are actually 2650 cells. They're a little bit bigger diameter. They're the same length, I do believe. Actually, they're just a tiny bit longer too. So yeah, these, I don't know if I should be doing it, but I'm going to add these to this pack so then I can get more amps out of this pack without heating up because right now one two three four five six seven eight what's eight eight times 2.75 if they can handle 2.75 that's a max of 22 amps this is my learning bike basically so if I have a fire or anything whatever I don't have much money into this bike this thing is massive. These cells tested out, I know my tester draws the voltage down a little too far, but these tested out 3600 and, and some are even more. There was some that hit, there's one over there, the light blue ones go even better, 3773 milliamp hours. Granted, my, my charger, I'll show you that, Where's, what do I use? This is the charger I use to test it. It's a Zanflare charger, not sure the model number. Zanflare model C4. It tests them at 500 milliamp drain. So you can charge it higher. You can charge them at one amp a piece, but when you're doing the test, the highest it goes is 500 milliamps. So yeah, I can't wait to test these new cells and see how they turn out. 
Like these here, the NCR18650PFs, they're rated at 2,750 milliamp hours. Typical is 2,900, and I'm getting 3,100 out of it. So that tells me that I'm probably taking it down a little too far than you're normally supposed to during a test. And I'm not sure exactly what that is yet. And I don't even know if I can set it in this. I don't think I can. But my purpose is just to test them so I can get my cell balanced evenly. So I can have the same amount of milliamps in this row, same amount 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 in this row, as close as possible. And if you look back on some of my other videos, there is a cell builder that I use that helps me calculate all that automatically. I just put in every individual cell and it makes the packs for me. It works really good. So you get to watch me crash and burn, literally. And yeah, if there's something that you see me obviously doing wrong that could be dangerous, please let me know because I'm learning. If you have any advice for me or anything, please let me know. I'm going to be talking about what controllers I'm using because right now I'm a little confused on that. But anyways, I'm going to end the video there. I just wanted to show you the cells I got, what I got going. I got some more cells to go with these that are coming and they're about the same specs. They're not the same battery because these I couldn't find. They were all sold out everywhere. So I found ones that are about the same specs and I'll show you those when I get them. Alright, see you then.